Recycling through manual dismantling. Dismantling a CRT cathode ray tube monitor. Removing the monitor casing. Place the monitor face down. Remove all visible screws from the CRT casing. Turn around the TV to access the screws on the other side. Remove the screws from the bottom part of the TV. Dismantle and remove the plastic casing. Opening the CRT glass body. To equalize the pressure in the CRT and the environment, it is necessary to remove the flap of the anode connection. Detach the anode connection flap. Carefully, punch a hole into the funnel glass with a hammer and a screwdriver. Wait until the pressure is equalized. This step needs to be completed before any further dismantling steps in order to avoid possible implosion of the CRT body. Separating the electronic components, the CRT tube assembly and the casing. Remove the cables around the CRT tube. Remove the screws from the casing holding the main printed circuit board, PCB. Unplug all remaining cables. Remove the CRT main PCB assembly. Unplug the cables to liberate the PCB over the electron gun. Cut off all cables which cannot be unplugged.
Remove the screws holding the CRT tube assembly and the casing. Lift out the CRT tube assembly. Remove the screws to separate the speakers from the casing. Remove the screws to separate the small PCB from the casing. Unplug the cable. Remove the PCB. Detach the plug PCB from the casing. Casings made exclusively of plastics can now be set aside as a plastic fraction. Dismantling of the CRT tube assembly. Remove the remaining cables around the CRT tube. Detach the PCB from the electron gun. Remove the metal stabilizer for the deflection yoke.
After all screws and stabilizers have been disassembled, remove the deflection yoke. Detach the electron gun from the rest of the CRT tube by carefully breaking the glass at its base with a hammer. Remove the electron gun. Hammer down any sharp spikes in order to avoid injuries. Dismantling of the CRT neck board assembly. Dismantle all larger components from the PCB. Cut all cables. Remove all mechanical stabilizers and plastic slots from the PCB. Material Cables Copper coil of the electron deflector Material assembly made of different metals PCBs Electron gun power cable Electron gun Plastic band Screws Grounding band PCBs Speakers